So, even though the newer episodes are better, my old multiversal episodes are absolute garbage. So, today I'm making an explained episode that explains everything that you need to know about the series so far. So, you can start off on this new playlist I'm making, Multiversal Phase 1, instead of watching Multiversal in Chronological Order. I love you. I said that like it was the end of the episode. Like, I love y'all. Bye. No. Um, but we're going to be seeing titles. Designs of titles. For new series that I'm making. Fantasy stories. Uh, portal jumpers. God Splitter. Ragnarok. Demon Hunters, my name is Jack, uh, ton tons of series. This, this, this intro is getting too long, let's get in! <gasps> All the members of the team, except for the members of the team who just went out for an attack, were circled around the table to explain something, well, pretty much everything. Even all the new members who have just arrived. Such as... You know what? Just go watch the last episode. I'm not naming all of them. Anyways, the first members of the team met whenever there was this weird thing that happened with the team's ex-villain... The Hush Killer. He came into a little boy's dimension and tried to kill him. Of course, our two new heroes that joined the team stopped this from happening and everything was fine. That was the first episode. And the second episode... They were, you know, doing random stuff, such as random. I'm pretty sure that that episode was the uh, episode where Caden went on a walk with Hush, the Hush Killer, our ex-villain guy. And we learned about one of the team's villains, Sakawan Claus, that we haven't checked in on in a while. But we'll see him soon. Maybe in Phase 2, though, because in Phase 1 right now, we're dealing with, uh, you know, the average... Uh, we're dealing with madness, and we're dealing with... Demok, but he's the corruption god now, so they they kind of got their hands full. In the third episode, Ezri and Justin go to a world that if you have your sanity, then you will shrink down to the size of a mouse. But if you don't have any sanity, you will grow massive. To the s well, you won't really grow massive, you'll stay the same size. And Justin ends up snapping in there and turns. At least I'm pretty sure from memory. And then they meet their new member of the team, Jared, who, boom, that's the next episode. Jared tells his backstory to the team, and oh, it's so sad. This wasn't actually part of Multiversal, that's why it's in Multiversal in Chronological Order, and not Multiversal Phase 1. But, it's still canon, and the two characters, the three characters in it, all end up joining the team. Stu, Remdahl, and Mrs. Wa Miss Waddleson. She's not married. And 
and they fight off element demons and the occasional symbiote demon. But then they get taken into a void where they have to somewhat, somewhat not fight Demok. And then Zombok and Ezri come. They try to deal with it. Zombok gets launched into another dimension and Ezri's able to escape. But the three main characters of that episode were also able to escape. Lucky them. In the next episode, Ezri let, makes a portal for Jack, Zack, and Tiny Kid to go back to their world to see that it's absolute havoc. And they end up fighting tons of bad guys. Then they get launched straight to hell. In the next episode, you get to see the tale of them going to hell and fighting their way through it with a new member of the team, Abby, and another person who will join the team later, Halo Craft. And, of course, they escape, blah, blah, blah. Blah, blah, blah. Achilles, you're so sassy. Anyways, yep, that's what happens, and I explained that rather quickly. So I'm just going to explain um, the episode after that. Uh, episode. So, so they come back to the base to find that the Hush Killer is there. They fight the Hush Killer, causing him to join the team, and then... Oh god, ow. Skip a few. And, uh, yeah, Hush Killer's now a member of the team. In the next episode, Ezri and Justin go to a very odd world where there is two new members of the team, Ajax and his daughter, Tammy. And then there's another two members of the team, a big ginormous jellyfish with muscular legs and a mushroom creature. That's it. Then in the next episode, they go to the biggest world in the multiverse and fight Madness and Demok. Madness and Demok end up getting away because Madness threat basically threatens Ezri. And then they all make it back out. And that's whenever everybody new joins the team. And now we're here. Jack. Zack and Tiny Kid run through the doors and scream out, Did anybody invite Demok here? In the next episode, we will figure out what happens there. Hope you enjoyed that episode and my sassiness because it's the weekend and I barely got any sleep tonight. So, um, yeah. So sassy. Okay. Well, uh, toodles. Love you, lovely weirdos.